Ever wondered how to grow tomatoes all year round? Well, you're not alone. Many gardeners dream of having a continuous supply of fresh, juicy tomatoes right at their fingertips. But the reality of growing tomatoes year-round can seem daunting. The first hurdle many gardeners face is the weather. Tomatoes are warm-weather crops, they love the sun, and they detest the cold. But what if you live in a region where the climate doesn't exactly favor this sun-loving plant? Or perhaps your area experiences harsh winters, or sweltering summers that are just too hot for tomatoes to thrive. These are common challenges that can make year-round tomato cultivation seem like an unattainable dream. But here's the good news. Understanding your climate is the first step towards overcoming these challenges. Every region has its unique weather patterns, and understanding these is crucial to growing tomatoes all year round. By paying attention to the seasons, the rainfall patterns, the temperature highs and lows, you can tailor your gardening practices to suit your climate. This means knowing when to plant your tomatoes, when to water them, and when to protect them from harsh weather conditions. However, understanding your climate is only one piece of the puzzle. Achieving year-round tomato growth also requires knowledge of the right tomato varieties to plant, the best ways to nurture your plants, and the ability to overcome common tomato gardening challenges. But don't worry, we've got you covered. In the upcoming scenes, we'll be sharing with you all the secrets you need to successfully grow tomatoes all year round. From choosing the right tomato variety for your climate, to nurturing your plants and overcoming common gardening challenges, we've got all the information you'll need. So, are you ready to transform your tomato gardening experience? Stay tuned as we delve into the secrets of successful year-round tomato gardening. Creating a conducive environment for your tomatoes is the first step towards a successful harvest. This environment encapsulates several key factors such as temperature, light, soil quality, and of course water. Let's delve into these factors. Temperature is paramount. Tomatoes are warm season crops, thriving best in daytime temperatures of 70 to 85 degrees Fahrenheit and nighttime temperatures of 60 to 70 degrees. If it gets colder than this, especially at night, growth can slow down or even stop. And what about light? Well, tomatoes love the sun. They need at least six to eight hours of sunlight each day. This is because sunlight fuels the photosynthesis process, which in turn leads to luscious, juicy tomatoes. Now let's talk soil. Tomatoes prefer a well-draining soil with a pH of 6 to 7. It should be rich in organic matter but not overly fertile. A soil that's too rich can lead to lush foliage but fewer fruits. And that's not what we're aiming for, is it? Hydration is another key factor. Tomato plants require consistent watering. If they get too dry, or conversely too wet, they can suffer from a variety of issues. These include blossom end rot, split fruits, and even reduced yield. So, maintaining a balance is crucial. Drainage goes hand in hand with hydration. Good drainage ensures that water doesn't pool around the roots, which can lead to root rot, a serious condition that can kill your plants. All these factors work together to create the ideal home for your tomatoes. Remember, happy plants are productive plants, and productive plants mean a bountiful harvest. Now that we've established the right environment, it's time to select the right tomato variety for your garden. Did you know that choosing the right tomato variety can make or break your tomato gardening success? It's not just about planting a seed and hoping for the best, it's about understanding the nature of the plant and aligning it with your specific environment. Tomatoes, like people, come in all shapes and sizes. Some like the heat, some can tolerate cold, while others need a lot of sunlight. And just like us, they too have their own personalities. So, let's dive into the world of tomatoes and find out which variety suits your garden the best. Firstly, let's talk about the determinate tomatoes, also known as bush tomatoes. These plants grow to a certain height, usually 3 to 4 feet, and then stop. They produce all their fruit at once, which makes them perfect for those of you who like to can or freeze your tomatoes. Some popular varieties in this category include Roma and Celebrity. Now if you're looking for a tomato plant that will keep you in tomatoes all summer long, you'll want to consider indeterminate tomatoes. These plants will continue to grow and produce fruit until the first frost. Varieties like beefsteak and brandywine fall into this category. For those living in cooler climates, cold-tolerant tomatoes are your best bet. Varieties such as stupis and glacier are known to perform well under cooler temperatures. And let's not forget about the heat-tolerant varieties. For those in warmer climates, varieties like Heatmaster and Solar Fire are designed to withstand the high summer temperatures and still produce a plentiful harvest. So whether you're a fan of the classic red tomato or fancy trying something a little different like a yellow or even purple variety, 
There's a tomato out there for everyone. It's about finding the right fit for you and your garden. The right variety is in the bag, but how do we ensure they grow healthy and bear fruit all year round? Nurturing your tomatoes is crucial in achieving a healthy and bountiful harvest. Let's dive right into the nitty gritty of tomato care. It's like tending to a beloved pet. You need to feed it, water it, and give it a good haircut now and then. Yes, you heard it right, a haircut, or in gardening terms, pruning. Watering your tomato plants is not just about dumping a bucket of water and calling it a day, it's about consistency. Tomato plants love a good drink, but they also enjoy well-drained soil. A rule of thumb is to water them deeply but infrequently. This encourages their roots to grow deeper into the ground, making them more resilient and better at sourcing nutrients. Feeding your tomato plants is the next big step. Tomatoes are heavy feeders. They need a rich diet to produce those juicy, tasty fruits we all love. A well-balanced fertilizer is just what they need. Look for one with equal parts nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Nitrogen promotes leafy growth. Phosphorus is for root development and flower production, and potassium aids in fruit development. Apply the fertilizer according to the package instructions, and remember, more is not always better. Now, let's talk about the haircut or pruning. Pruning helps direct the plant's energy towards fruit production rather than unnecessary leaf growth. The key is to remove the suckers, those small shoots that sprout out between the main stem and the branches. But don't go overboard. Leaving some suckers allows the plant to have enough foliage to protect the fruit from sun scald. So, there you have it. Watering, fertilizing, and pruning are the trifecta of tomato care. They're the secret to nurturing your tomato plants and setting them up for a bumper harvest. Remember, tomato plants are like any other living thing. They respond to care, attention, and a little bit of love. With proper care and attention, your tomato plants can thrive in any season. Tomato gardening can come with its own set of challenges. But don't worry, we've got you covered. Let's dive into the most common issues that tomato gardeners face. You may encounter pests, diseases, and unexpected weather fluctuations that can put your tomatoes at risk. But fear not, with the right strategies, you can prevent or manage these issues efficiently. First, pests. These can range from tiny insects to larger critters. The best defense is a good offense. Regularly inspect your plants for any signs of pests. If you spot any, act swiftly. Non-chemical solutions like hand-picking and organic sprays can help keep your plants pest-free. Next up, diseases. Tomatoes can be susceptible to a variety of diseases including blight and wilt. To combat these, ensure your plants have good air circulation and aren't overcrowded. Regularly remove dead or diseased leaves to prevent the spread of infection. And remember, rotation is key. Don't plant tomatoes in the same spot year after year to stop diseases from taking hold. Lastly, let's talk about weather fluctuations. Tomatoes love the sun and warmth, but too much heat or sudden cold snaps can stress them out. Regular watering can help your plants cope with heat, while cloches or row covers can provide protection from unexpected chills. The most important part of overcoming these challenges is regular monitoring and early intervention. Keep a close eye on your plants, and if you notice anything off, act fast. Your tomatoes will thank you for it. With these tips and tricks, you're now equipped to grow tomatoes all year round. 